Welcome to clickmyproject.com Let we discuss about our product title is Approximate Dynamic Site Both Multipliers for Low Power and High Performance Operation Let we see our product abstract In our process we are going to the two approximate 12 bit multiplier based on the Radix 8 both algorithm are proposed in our process the both multiplier consists of stage of multiplier encoding the partial product generation the partial product accumulations the final additions in our product the Radix 8 both algorithm and we are going to do a partial product in nine type of the process are generated by the multiplier encoder the partial product generator moreover the is used the implementation of the sum of the partial product to reduce the total multiplication time. The selections of partial product as input to the balance tree is controlled by the partial product generator. And then the determine the multiplier encoder, we go into the partial product generator and then input signals of ones and two three four process. The decoding the process occurred in the radix 8 algorithm in our one bit to multiply time and the corresponding the call with the add up functions the end gate of uh, select the postal product and perform the shift operations while the XR gate complete the inversions of the positive multiplies of the multiple time negative factors with the using the 12 bit multiply the radix 8 recording the algorithms generator 6 digit and the 6 partial product has generated the process the inverting the po partial product are accumulated by the virus tree in this process uh, the approximation of the adder and the 16 bit both multiplier two approximate designs of uh, the proposed in the accumulation stage and then the multiplier recording the result for that using the both multipliers has been widely used the high performance level and to multiplication encoding the process so consider 12 bit signed multipliers the primarily addition is a process at the least significant bit for the same for x and y process are mean uh, one input to another input sign bit for the process because the sign does not change the multiplication in the multiplied the by the process we use the only 12 bit of the middle of the process the carry propagation of 12 bit adder takes the significant the time compared with the shifting to reduce the ripple carry propagations to adjustment bits process let we see our process flow diagram in our process we have giving the 12 cross 12 bit multiply in the input functions and we go into the main blocks the main blocks the 24 bit multiplier operations will be perform in the multipliers the basic gate logic or first design then to give the 12 cross 12 uh, bit for input the to the multiplier uh, we have designed the 144 and gates designed and by using the realization of gates the partial product generation will be done the performed uh, 24 multipliers logics as the result partial product generations the 24 bits will be provided as output uh, now we discuss the partial product generations the process the both multiply has been while while you use the high performance signed multiplications by encoding and thereby reducing the number of partial products a multiplier using the radix 4 algorithm is very efficient due to the easy to the partial product generations whereas the radix 8 both or multiplies is slow due to the complexity of generations the add multiplies of the multiplication in the paper process and then the the application of the approximate designs and 2 bit adder is a design for the calculations of sum of 1 and 2 of binary numbers this adders require small area and small uh, low power but a short critical path delay process the 2 bit adder implementation of the less section of recording adder the generation triple multiplications no carry propagations after we go into the rpr blocks in our process we consume the 16 bit approximate radix 8 both the multiplayer designs approximate recording in the headers with the 
uh, with and without the truncation of the process the less uh, significant beats the process product and the multipliers the faster and more power efficient than the accurate both multipliers the multipliers with the 15 bit uh, truncation achieves the best overall performance in the process approximate the both level process and then we go into use the uh, d flip flop for process for the 24 bit in the 24 bit we uh, split the 12 class 12 bit uh, multipliers after using the d flip flop from the uh, each and every uh, bit from the uh, single input after going to the multiplayer logic in the lo multiplayer logic we go into the simulate the process since this result we get the how much of uh, complexity we will reduce and power and uh, area of process the power efficiency accurate in the both multipliers the we got the threshold logic process finally the approximate multipliers applied from the comparison blocks from the show the better performance of the approximate in the compared to both multipliers after the first and power efficiency from the accurate and performance times for the hardware accuracies let me see our process running processor in our process we have uh, implemented in the uh, silence 14.2 versions uh, in the told crash told multiplayer process uh, first of all uh, we go going to the simulate the process uh, just we are go simulation and which the main program we will select the, and then we go into the simulate the behavioral model um, after running the process completed uh, automatically open the iSIM simulator uh, we give the uh, clack and enable and the right functions we give the input and once it's completed automatically uh, running process uh, we get the uh, we got output for the 24 bit process now uh, uh, the iSIM simulator is open uh, we can give the input for the functions and the clack and the enable functions uh, we have already give the input in the programs what are the input for the uh, the 12 bit and uh, a and b two level um, input after we go into the to the give the uh, clack for the force clack so leading edge value is zero and trailing edge value is one and period thousand ms after completing this process, please go into the give the force constant and then give it force to value. So one is a reset value. After this complete this we go into the running the process. Just we run after we go to the reset the process for zero. When we give the enable is zero reset is zero, we got the output to this full fledged. So other time we will not uh, achieve the output results is fulfilled. So now we are going to the run the process. We got the full output for the process. Each and every uh, variable signals we get the output. And then uh, just we give the input uh, three type of uh, clack signals. We just uh, show the zoom functions. So this is a multiplex process. You don't get the process. Just like we zoom the process. We got the uh, result output for the 24 bit uh, for multiplayers to 12 uh, 12 class 12 multiplayers for count the output for the 24 bit. So we complete the process simulation or completed. After we go into the uh, implementation result, the implementation is we must uh, run the process for the synthesis, synthesis report and uh, implementation result. So the synthesis report we go into the running the process. Uh, is completed uh, completed after we go into the implementation decisions also we have we should run the process uh, here only we uh, simulate the process uh, uh, how much area is occupied and the power assumption uh, this results is uh, considered from here only uh, here uh, we show the output for the device utilization summary uh, here after completing the implementation design we go into the detailed reports for synthesis report at the same time for design summary for device utilization summary here we give, let's give the result for the process how much we using the slice LUTs process how much use the logic how much LUTs flip flop pairs and then flip flop and use it process and the IOB bit. Uh, this process is a very important for the LUTs flip flop flip flop pairs and IOB process. So this process completed we go into the time process. So timing uh, 
how much time we give the the time report how much time we get the running the time for here so it will be take the 12.598 nanoseconds the full process completed it will be take the IC that take the time for the this time 12.589 nanos thank you watching our website